Collision, or clash detection, is available in the SolidCam simulator between all components. Let's take a look at this example here. Here we have a pocketing toolpath, which is machining this face. And then afterwards, we have a tool, which is machining from that face down to here. If we were to reorder these operations, such that the slotting operation occurs before, if we launch our simulation, we will see collisions. After the simulation is played, you can see information about the collisions. There's a note here that's saying collisions are detected. We can hover our mouse over any of the markers. These markers are created at the toolpath positions where the collision occurred. If you hover over the collision, you can see detailed information about the collision, such as whether the arbor and stock collided, whether the cutting collided during a rapid movement, or whether there was a collision between a fixture and a cutting part of the tool or an arbor or a holder. You can highlight the marks and click on them to toggle between the start and end of the clash. On some of the clashes, you can get detailed information in the form of a black border which is showing the intersection of the colliding components. Some collisions show a very distinct collision, such as when the holder here is colliding with the stock. Many times collisions are just a very thin portion, and this black border can be very difficult to see. You can also double click to reposition the simulation to that point and continue playing from that position. Collision detection is enabled or disabled in the menu or the theme editor. And you can also have an option to stop the playback on a clash, such that if we restarted the simulation, at the first collision, the simulation will stop.